about how it's going to do that to provide high recall for the query. But if there's an index, we'll always use the index. Okay, interesting. And uh, what are the other types of indexes that uh, are typically useful? And you know, how does it decide, like based on the nature of the data or the the queries it has seen, or how does it like decide what kind of index would be suitable? Um, or maybe multiple indexes, and the query planner can decide oh, use this index and use that. There's multiple types of ANN. Again, these are the approximate neighbor indexes um, that are in use today in production. I'd say in broad strokes, there are two that are most used. There are the centroid based ones. That's what TurboPuffer uses because it works best for OPIC storage and it works really well for lots of writes um, for reasons we can get into if you want to get into that. And then there are the graph based indexes. The graph based indexes are phenomenally fast at queries, right? So where a centroid-based index might take a millisecond, a graph-based index might take 100 microseconds, right? Um, but it, everything has to be generally in memory for a graph-based index. Um, so that's the downside. So if you're doing 100,000 queries per node per second and you want to do it in a, on, in a single node, it's very hard to beat a graph index. Um, but very few people are doing that. Mm -hmm. um, so that's why we think the centroid-based approach is, is very, very good for a lot of workloads. Um, the graph-based indexes, if we just get into it a little bit, um, a graph-based index, um, you can imagine as you try to build a graph over time where um, vectors that are close in vector space are also connected in the graph. Mm -hmm. Then essentially you can imagine that you start in the middle of the graph and then you look at, okay, this, this graph might have, like say 64 um, other nodes or vectors that it's connected to. I'm gonna go and look at the one that I'm closest to and perform a greedy search. Then I have a priority queue of what's 